Welcome. So I want to do one more problem uh, when we have our x minus k. And we need to go ahead and solve for it, and we're going to be doing some fractions. So in this case, we'll just take our uh, divisor, 3x plus 2, and we'll set it equal to 0. So subtract 2. So we have 3x equals negative 2. Divide by 3, divide by 3. x equals a negative 2 thirds. So I'm going to place that on the top or on the outside of my box. Then I'm going to take the coefficients of each term. Notice that I do not have a linear term, so we're going to use 0 for that. So I have 15, uh, 15, positive 10, negative 6, uh, and 0, and then a positive 14. You've got to make sure we include that 0, or we're going to have some problems. So the first thing is I bring down the 15. So 15 times a negative 2 thirds is going to be, uh, let's see, 3 is going to divide into 30 10 times. So that's going to be a negative 10. Negative, uh, so 2 times that would be negative 30. Negative 30, 30 divided by 3 will be a negative 10. 10 plus negative 10 is 0. 0 times a negative 2 thirds is going to be 0. Negative 6 plus 0 is negative 6. Negative 6 times a negative 2 thirds is going to be a positive 12 over 4, which is going to be a positive 12 over 3, I'm sorry, which will be a positive 4. 0 plus 4 is going to be 4. 4 times a negative uh, 2 thirds will be a negative 8 thirds. So now what we need to do is we need to convert our 14 over to a, a decimal. I'm sorry, not a decimal, but over to a fraction with a denominator of 3. So I'll multiply by 3 over 3. So I have 14, 28. So that's going to be 42 over 3. So 42 over 3 plus a negative 8 over, uh, 8 over 3 is going to be a uh, negative uh, 34, or I'm sorry, positive 34 over 3. So that's going to be our remainder, constant, linear, quadratic, cubic. So you can see now we have the coefficients for each term plus our remainder. So our quotient is 15x cubed. We don't need to write the plus 0x squared minus 6x plus 4 plus our remainder of 34 over 3 divided by 3x plus 2. But then again, to kind of get this off of our denominator, we can rewrite this as 34 over 3 times 3x plus 2. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you solve your final. Um, that's how you solve using synthetic division or find the quotient. Thanks.